Hi, my name is Desmond. I just want to tell you about my new invention in photography that I call super speed photography. With normal high speed photography you need a slow shutter speed and you freeze the action with flash. With my new invention, using the capacitor of the flash, I can do high speed photography at any shutter speed. What I've done is I've cut the wire off the end of the flash tube and run it in series with an electronic ignition coil. So that when I take the picture, the energy that goes through the flash also goes through the coil and triggers a 50,000 volt spark. Don't try this at home because that capacitor in there could kill you. I'm using a Nikon D40 which is actually ideal for the job here because it has an electronic shutter. It fires the sensor electronically, it doesn't rely on a focal plane shutter. So I can capture this at any speed. And that was at one five hundredth of a second. I've captured that spark. Okay, now I've taken the wire off the coil. And I've got these two wires going through that capacitor to a solenoid, and I've got a needle on the end of that solenoid. This is from a diesel fuel pump. It switches at quite a high speed, and I'm hoping to capture a balloon full of water bursting without using flash. And the needle has stuck into the rubber. And the balloon is leaking. You have to fill it up a bit more so it bursts. Okay, so let's try again. Got the water, the balloon more full of water this time. Gotta get close enough without bursting it now. I hope the wind doesn't interfere. And we take another photo. At one two hundredth of a second, one four hundredth of a second. Got the movement of the needle, but that was too fast. Hope I don't get electrocuted here. Right, I've got pretty close now. I'm going to try a much slower shutter speed. Hope the wind doesn't burst it for me. That's 10 now, 160th of a second. Yes! And that did it. Success.